Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to get a great photo of a church or other old buildings using your camera phone. I'm Tara Rai from Atelier M Studio and you can find me here. I'm at a church in southern Italy and one of the best things you can do to get a picture of any sort of old building is to change your perspective. As you can see, there are a few people close to the church. However, I am standing in a backed up corner with the, one of the walls in the city and there's nobody near me. And I'm gonna take the picture from here. And the one thing to point out in trying to find your perspective is to take some time to look around from where you can get a kind of better perspective than the usual one where people take the photo up front of the church and one of the things that it does when you kind of get a perspective farther away is that the people look small and when the people look small it adds to the grandiosity of actually how big that building is and in this shot I actually messed up the angle and so I'm gonna show you how I fix that later here I'm at another church in southern Italy and one of the things I wanted to point out is to make sure that the church is nicely lit and even with the sky. So as you can see the sun is appearing and part of the church becomes gets in the shadow and so I wouldn't recommend taking the photo when the full church is in shadow and the sky is really bright. And I'm going to talk you in this part through the editing process. I'm using an iPhone, but this is also applicable for Android phones. And I go to the edit portion, so whether that's in photos or gallery, and I hit on the crop symbol. And in this case, the auto function comes up and I'm going to use that. And that'll automatically adjust the horizontal and the vertical elements of my photo and you can also do this manually by using the horizontal vertical elements and the straighten element and I'm going to crop it here as you do lose part of the photo when you adjust perspective a little bit and after that I'm going to apply my filter which I use Snapseed filter accentuate for this and then I added a sky Thanks for listening. I'm Tara Rai from Atelier M Studio and you can find me here. This video is also part of a blog article and for further videos please subscribe to my channel. Thanks.